Despite its size, Malta boasts a lot of talent. Artists, musicians, designers, entrepreneurs. A lot of these travel to places around the world, leaving a mark wherever they go, thus raising awareness about the islands of Malta and Gozo. This week, our spotlight goes on the high fashion brand duo Charles and Ron, who have just returned from an exciting New York Fashion Week. We are by the pool at the Corinthia Palace Hotel and Spa with Charles, who have just come back from, from New York Fashion Week. Welcome back. Thank you. How Hello. was it? It was fantastic. I was following on, uh, on social media, on Facebook and Instagram, and it looked like it was a really exciting time. It was, it was an incredible experience. Tell us a bit about it. Um, well, it was our third time participating in Fashion Week. Um, we showed the Spring Summer 2016 collection together with uh, some other designers. Um, um, well, the event is called Nolcha, mm -hmm. Nolcha events, because there are several um, events that organize fashion shows during Fashion Week. And we started off um, uh, the show, the event for that you were, night. You were interviewed by a lot of international magazines while you were there and, yes. and TV stations. Yes, yes, and yes. Uh, I was following like Charles and Ron here <laughs> and there. So the, even the collection itself, um, you always say in your interviews that you were inspired by the Mediterranean islands, that Malta and Gozo. Um, what was this uh, collection inspired by? This collection was inspired by our Maltese traditional boat, which we call the Lutsu. Mm -hmm. um, it's vibrant, beautiful colors that you see them in the sea. Um, uh, and the inspiration came really, I like to visit Marsa Schlock every Sunday to the, to the market, the fish market. So um, I always see these beautiful boats and we took some couple of pictures and we transformed it into prints on fabrics. The Maltese boats are very unique and um, I saw from the sketches that you that you place them yes. on the sketches first and then from there the design yes. Uh, yes. comes alive. Yes. So it's amazing how, how you are so creative and you come up with these things. Charles, you won the Mediterranean Prize this year. Yes. Tell us a little bit about it. Um, the Mediterranean Fashion Prize um, is uh, an organization and thank you. And they choose a, a designer mm -hmm. from every country, which is part of the Mediterranean Sea. Um, uh, they give them training with five experts, fashion experts from Paris. Um, and this is supported by uh, Christian Dior and Chanel. So it's a very big thing. Um, uh, and they guide you how to get ready to start preparing um, uh, if you would like to sell abroad, you want to take a further, like a business kind of thing. So they, uh, they give you tips on uh, the laws that there are on your label, um, the branding, all sorts of things, you know, the strategy of the company. So it's very, very interesting. Now, uh, next year, they're going to do a very big event because they are getting together the 50 designers that won throughout the years. And uh, Christian Dior just uh, sponsored the whole event. So we're going to be there again. We're going to be part of a, yes, another show, um, which is very, very exciting. And we also uh, can exhibit our collection in a museum in Marseille. So it's, thank you. Um, and finally, your, um, we know that you have a, a shop here at the Corinthia, in Atard. Um, you also have shops in Dubai, am I right? We, we sell, uh, uh, we don't, it's not our shop, but we do supply our handbags in a, in a shop in Dubai. And have you got any plans for more outlets here in Malta? Yes, in fact, we are opening our flagship store in Valletta, um, uh, which is next to the... City? Yes, <laughs> it's a very exciting thing for us. It's going to be next to the palace in Republic Street. Um, uh, and hopefully it's going to be you know, opening very soon. And it will, you'll have the clothes and yeah, the accessories. Together with our accessories and, and bag collection. Coming! <laughs> well, let's come to the launch soon. Yes. And thank you so much, Charles, for your time. I know you're really busy. Thank you for having me. And um, I really look forward to see what you're going to come with, up with next. 
Thank you. And uh, that's it from me. Bye. <laughs>